from the JR station it's very very close to the port and from here you can take the rabbit line to Okonoshima which is Rabbit Island. From the JR station it's very very close to the port and from here you can take the rabbit line to Okonoshima which is Rabbit Island so get your tickets uh, go and return our 2400 yen so let's hop onto the boat and meet some rabbits Where are you from? Uh, I'm from Australia. What brings you to Mihara? Well, today we've been using our JR Pass to travel all throughout Japan and today we come to Mihara because we were going to go to the Bunny Island. Okay. How was it for to come from Hiroshima to Mihara? Was it difficult? No, not at all. It was super easy. I just used my JR Pass from the station to Mihara and then literally followed the bunny signs all throughout the footpath which brought us to this port. It was simple. It was easy. Okay guys, and I'm going to show you now how to get from the station to the boat so you can take the rabbit line over to Rabbit Island. <laughs> ah, and we're already at Mihara Station! That was a quick walk. See, that was easy. here at Mihara station that was easy right you just follow the little bunny signs on the road and you're straight there and that's it from Mihara today guys what did you find interesting and what would you like to see a little bit more of leave us your comments we're gonna give about seven postcards we got from Okonoshima which is Rabbit Island for the best comments so leave us your comments now and we're gonna announce the winners in a week's time on our community tab so be sure to also click on the little bell symbol on Ash Japanese so you get notified in case you won a little postcard and we send it from Japan right out to you
hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to leave a big like on the way out. And we're looking forward to reading lots and lots of your comments. So I'll catch you soon on Ash Japanese. Bye.